Hello, and today I love Blackyard Survival. Well, I'm going to show you guys how to uh, basically deshell and devein fish easily with a tool. Just going to that. Um, called the Shrimper. Um, it's made by. It's made by Mortsy'sKnives.com. Um, you can probably find them in your local fish market. So, basically, instead of hand peeling them like I am now, where you have to split it down like this, you have to peel back the shell like this. Just peeling it back, pulling it off, the head off, and there, we got a pretty cool shrimp. The only problem is, it's not deveined. Look, the top is still intact, and you can't see on this one, unfortunately, but the vein is still in there, so I have to cut that open, the back open, and get the vein out, which... Just have to cut it like this, and all the way up, which I'm not the best at this because I don't use this often because I'm using my D, D, my shrimper. But anyway, you can see how I'm just pulling all that veinage out, which really, it's like feces, shrimp feces, and all that good stuff. And then finally, I'm done. And you can get good at that and do it pretty fast. But this tool does it only one. Hard plastic, because it's not going to break on you. And even if it does break, like say the tip snaps off, I've seen them. They're still functional. Some people prefer the tip shorter. So you can see it's curved. You can probably make this if you want to. Okay? You're going to hold the shrimp. I'll get another one so you can see this better. Hold the shrimp. There's a little hole right there. See the black stuff? The little hole right there. See. Yep. That black stuff in there is all the veinage. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this and we're going to put it in in the back where the veins are. Or the feces. And you're going to straighten the shrimp out and slowly, see, right along the top until make sure not to come through the shell too early and come out the end and you're just going to keep pushing forward and what that does is it pulls all the veins off and it pulls all the shells off so now you can see and uh, now it even it opens it up for me so even if there is veins in there I can I can just pull them out with my hands. So let's do this a little faster. Right along. So yeah, be careful not to go through the shell. See, I can go through it early. But you can just push that back in. And then once it's like that, then it's all downhill. And the veins are still in there. But sometimes they'll get out. Sometimes they'll still be in there. But it opened up the whole back ridge. So you don't have to do that cutting part they're easier to clean. So now I'm just going to do a couple for you. So hole, go in the back, straighten it out right along the back, keep pushing, and look, perfect. The vein, you cut all the way down, the veins all the way out, oops, sorry, the veins all the way out, the, now look, now I just take this, go to the end, Pinch that a little and pull, and perfect shrimp. So let's do a couple more. Oh, see, that's a nice big black vein back there. You're gonna wanna push that everything into that little tiny hole. 
I'm just going to want to push forward. And again, it's dangling. And there's actually some veinage in there, so I'm just going to wipe that out. And pull it off. Now you see there's some veinage in there. Just pull that off. And look, it's all gone. And that simple. Okay, so uh, I'll do like, let's see how fast I can go. So, let's see. You saw the first one. Now look. Done. That's just one. Oh, don't stop the clock yet. <laughs> Devein, Devein. It's done. Okay, let's see. Let's see another one. It's definitely. I mean, I bet you could do it quicker, but it's definitely faster than doing them by hand. Hook, hanging by the end, pinch at the very end, and pull a little. The veins are still in there, so I'm just going to ride this along and scrape down any veins that are in there. If you do it good and take your time, the veins will just come out naturally anyway. Okay, so the veins, I'm going to push everything back in that little tiny hole. Keep pushing. The key. The, the special part about this is it gets it, all the shells off in one piece and okay it looks like you you spent like a minute with your knife cutting in and it looks actually pretty professional look at that it's nicely cut open looks like you get in a restaurant and those take a long time to cut the back off when you can simply do this. I know, I know the place where I got this, they actually use it every day to shrimp. So, okay. So I'm just going to do like two more. Remember, in the like black veiny hole, out, keep pushing right along, cut the contours to the shrimp shape, keep pushing. It's going to split, keep and we'll uh, pull everything off and as you can see there's the shrimp shell right on there and just like that it's done and you check for the veins perfect center line and let's see let's see uh look in here let's see let's see how fast i can do all those ready no more how are we doing on time Oh, okay. Let's see. I have three min uh, two minutes to do all these. Let's see how many I can get done. This one was complicated. It was a little screwed up to begin with, so. Um, a lovely assistant. Just turn off the camera when it gets to, like, 9.50. I'm going to go two over. And not, yep, at 9.50. Okay. 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 And you guys do this a lot, you'll get really good at it. Oops. Careful at the front because it's sharp and pointy. Look at the garbage. Okay, I only got a few left. How are we doing on time? 990? Okay, let's see if we can finish this up. That whole big pile. Okay, remember 950, you shut it off. Okay, well, this has been Numbers Backyard Survival. Adios, amigos.